After I took off the frownies, I felt like a real housewife because my face kind of felt stiff. If I was a real housewife, this would be my catchphrase. I'm free of wrinkles, but absolutely not free of the drama. What up guys, my name is Kate and I'm gonna be testing out the viral TikTok product, Frownies. Now, I'm not saying that I have severe wrinkles. I'm a spring chicken. But people have been saying that the results are similar to Botox. Do I believe them? No. But I need to know for myself if this is true or if this is not true. I am going to focus my efforts on my forehead area, specifically on the right side of my face, because my brows have a life of their own. They love to dance, but when they dance, it does cause some wrinkles. So I'd love to see if this reduces those fine lines or if it just leaves them there and my brows can dance happily. The frownies came in a square pink container in an accordion-like fold. Begin by washing your face and add moisturizer. There is a glossy and non-glossy side to the frownies. You can cut or tear a piece off. Using a bit of water on your finger, rub the glossy side of the frowny till it gets tacky. Flatten out the area of skin you want to place the frowny on and apply pressure when pushing it down. Keep it on for three hours or overnight. To remove, add water to it and slowly pull it off. I'm gonna try on the frownies tonight and we are gonna see if we can see a difference. Just to see honestly also if my forehead doesn't move as much in the morning. Here is the patch. I'm just gonna rip them apart and then add water to them. They're pretty easy to do. It's almost like a little like ripping up a band-aid of sorts. So then I'm just gonna add water to my finger and put them on. You can also spray water. Um, and I'm going to start right up here. So any line we see, I'm just gonna kind of like flatten out and then put in the middle. I'm gonna do another one. I'm gonna do this more on my forehead area. I'm thinking like to use this whole thing for the smile line. I'm gonna hold it here. It's like just like a slight line. I don't really know how to flatten it out. Okay. And that's that. Not gonna lie, this one kind of tickles. Like it literally, I wanna laugh. It tickles. So here is my face in the morning and some things I can say that I learned is that I move my face at night. Like I think I'm just creating wrinkles at night because I guess I'm like trying to move my face all night long. But this prevented me from doing that. I could feel that my face couldn't move. I'm just taking them off with a damp cloth. I probably should have put more water on that because it was a pull. Okay. I definitely should have put more water on that so it didn't like rip off my face. My brow, normally I move it way up. This is me legit trying to move it. This side is more active than this side and this side is always more active. That's crazy. Oh my God. We can see some redness here. That's my own fault. I didn't wet it enough when pulling it off. And some redness here, same, but like, this is more liney than this side, and this side is always more liney. That's actually crazy. This is me trying to move my forehead. What the hell? I've always been able to like make a scrunch here. Literally can't do it. I'm actually shocked. It has been a week of me wearing frownies and I need to say that I am shocked by two things. Number one, I'm shocked at how much my face wanted to move at night. The frownies kept me in place, kept me concrete, but my face wanted to scrunch up, wanted to move so much in the night. And number two, I'm shocked at how well it worked. Honestly, when I was sleeping, I could tell I wanted to raise my eyebrows, but the frowny would not let it happen. So it was kind of training my muscle not to move and not to create these excessive wrinkles through excessive movements. I think the one area where I struggled really with it was on the smile line right here. I think that piece of skin is just kind of hard to manage because it's kind of in a weird angle. It's a lot of movement near the mouth. 
so I don't know if I'll continue putting frownies in that area. I'm really happy with this product. I think that it does work. I feel like it teaches your muscles not to over accentuate themselves, over move, but it's not as invasive as something like Botox. Test it out, what do you have to lose, except maybe a few wrinkles. Comment below if you would try out this product. Remember to like, subscribe, turn on those post notifications, and we'll see you next time. Thank you.